The gut microbiota plays a very important role in regulating our stress responses. We're seeing more and more now that interventions that target the gut microbiota may be beneficial in actually treating stress-related disorders like, I suppose, irritable bowel syndrome, anxiety disorders, maybe even depression. There is a neuronal connection between the gut and the brain, the vagus nerve. And the vagus nerve transmits impulses from the gut microbes to the brain. The gut microbes also produce various chemicals that can influence the brain. Short chain fatty acids like butyrate and acetate are produced by the metabolic activity of the gut microbes. There are peptides that come from the gut, cytokines that can influence the brain as well. The gut microbiota seems to be abnormal in a number of brain-related conditions. We showed a few years ago that in an animal model of depression that the gut microbiota was, was changed. We've now shown that in patients with depressive illness that they do have a different microbiota. And interestingly, when we transplant the microbiota from a depressed patient into an animal, the animal develops depressive features. Other brain-related conditions which have alterations in gut microbiota are probably Parkinson's disease it begin in the gut and that some sort of toxin may spread up from the gut into the brain and bring about the classic changes we see in the brain as brains of patients with Parkinson's disease. The other uh, important disease is autism. There have been a number of recent studies which demonstrate that the microbiota in autism may be altered um, and that perhaps altering the microbiota using antibiotics or possibly even a fecal microbiota transplantation may have positive benefits in some patients with autism. Approximately half the patients who present with irritable bowel syndrome to clinics have either depression or anxiety associated with the irritable bowel syndrome. The two occur together, but they're not causally related. I think a very intriguing question is whether or not probiotic treatment, which actually benefits patients with irritable bowel syndrome, would their depression or anxiety respond as well? Yes.